Hi everyone, Erin here from Real Wig Fun. So perhaps you've already heard that Raquel Welch has come out with three new styles. And I guess they're not technically new, but what is new is that these three styles that were previously only available in brick and mortar stores are now available on sale online, which is so exciting for all of us. So this is one of those styles and this is called Ahead of the Curve and I have this style in glazed sand, so stay tuned. So if you're interested in purchasing Ahead of the Curve, you can head over to my friends at wigsbypattiespearls.com. I will be reviewing all three of these new styles that are now available for sale online, but we're gonna start with Ahead of the Curve. And this style is absolutely gorgeous. What you may be surprised about though is Ahead of the Curve is not made from heat defiant synthetic fiber, rather it is regular synthetic and Raquel Welch calls their regular sy synthetic Vibrolite fiber. And I gotta tell you, when I first took this wig out of the box, it could have fooled me because typically you know that I love my heat defiant fibers partly because they feel very fine, they feel very lifelike, they come to me with a lot less shine than regular synthetic wigs do. So in my experience, when I opened the box of Ahead of the Curve, this particular style, I felt it right away and the fibers felt really great, they felt really fine. What I will tell you is I have applied a little bit of dry shampoo onto this style. That's the only thing that I've done to it ahead of the review, but I certainly wanted to let you know that. So ahead of the curve is this shorter style with sophisticated layers and bouncy body with these this really gorgeous diagonal bang that I think a lot of you are really gonna like. So this style does have a temple to temple lace front. It has a left-handed monofilament part. And I will do a turn so that you can see this gorgeous style from all sides. So clearly this is my front. I did want to mention from a density because I get that question asked a lot is, you know what, Erin, does it have a lot of permatease? Is it really dense or is it really natural in density? And I would say that this is average to normal density. It's feeling really good. And my tendency and preference is on the lower density end. So this style is feeling great on me. The other thing that I want to do before I do a turn is to show you this lace front. So this color is glazed sand. It is an unrooted shade. I typically gravitate towards rooted shades, especially because I change my hair color quite often and I am naturally not a blonde. Shocker to everybody I know. Um, I have naturally medium to dark brown hair um, of the hair that I do have but this lace front is looking really good. So because you have a wig with such a great lace front, what it allows you is that flexibility, whether you wanna style it away from your face or whether you wanna push that beautiful diagonal bang off to the side. You know, because the hairline is so natural, you could wear it off your face very comfortably. And this is my right side the back. I'll turn down my collar. It's probably easier for you to be able to see the nape that way. And then my left hand side. And then back to the front. Let's talk about the dimensions on ahead of the curve. So these front bang sections, these fronts are seven inches, which makes sense because my face, it could be a touch longer than seven inches. It's about seven inches because my measurement from hairline to chin is seven inches. Okay, um, the crown is seven and a half. The nape is three and three quarters. The sides are seven and then the back is eight inches. And then all together, this wig weighs 3.5 ounces. So it's a light wig, easy to wear, something that you're gonna be able to wear comfortably all day long. It is an average size cap. I have a 22 inch circumference head. I did not make any adjustments out of the box and it's fitting me beautifully. Anyways, let's take a look at the inside of Ahead of the Curve. And as I mentioned before, it's got a left-handed monofilament part, and then it has that beautiful extended lace front. An extended lace front for me is one of the most important cat features. And that's 
because I like wearing the hair away from my face or at least having the flexibility of doing so. So I really love this about this particular style. That we have the felt covered ear tabs. There are metal stays in there. And all the metal stay does is it allows you to press down on it so that this side of this wig is sitting really flush to your face. And then you've got open wefted sides and back. And this is called an extended nape. If it was a, if the, if the nape was not extended, the depth of this would be about in half. What I really like about an extended nape is on, in particular, on shorter styles, it helps to ensure that that wig stays at the base of your neck. And then you've got the Velcro adjusters. And I explained it this way the other day. Velcro adjusters are kind of like a belt. Okay, so if your head circumference is smaller than mine, mine's a 22 inch circumference head. If yours is, for example, 21 and a half, maybe it's 21, you would want to pull these Velcro adjusters in tighter just to adjust this cap size so that it better fit you. So lastly, let's talk about this beautiful color glazed sand. And one thing I didn't know when I first started wearing wigs is that if you're looking at a straight synthetic, in this case, Vibrolite fiber versus an HD synthetic, you may not see the same names or the exact same colors between the two different uh, fiber types. Okay, so again, this is Vibrolite non heat friendly synthetic. It's a bit of a mouthful. But anyways, this gorgeous shade is not rooted, as you can tell. So for the, all you ladies that do not like rooted colors, glazed sand perhaps is one that you want to take a look at. And it is a honey blonde with ash highlights. I love the mix of that, of that honey, which gives you a little bit of warmth, but then neutralizes it a little bit with those ash highlights. I think it's a gorgeous shade. So I hope you've enjoyed taking a look at the brand new Raquel Welch Ahead of the Curve, now available for sale online. Stay well and stay safe. Bye everybody.